That'll be so sweet, London. That was so cool. What does she mean by beat to a pulp? Kill the human? I hope not. Hey, you heard the captain. I don't know where the place is, so you have to lead. Oh, uh, everyone, please follow me. I'll show you to Miss Hannah's house. I'll follow in the trees with the brownies. Okay, I'll take care of these two. Everyone, please try to stay hidden. For Venice says the Fae can't hide us right now. Bria, don't run off. But Mom, I can go there by myself. I know you can. I, I just... I want you to be safe, okay? Ghost Fae, you look sad. Is it because you're scared? I guess I am a bit scared. I'm worried I won't be able to fix this mess. Don't worry. You saved Cousin Bron, so... I trust you. But I... You're still scared? My mom said it's okay to be scared, because that's what brave people do. Yeah, brave people do things when they're scared. Guess I'll just have to be brave. Yeah, we'll be brave too. Oh, and uh, when I'm worried, I talk to my mom and dad. You can talk to them too. Okay. Ron? <laughs> yeah? What do you think the captain will do to the human? Eh, take its soul, probably. Its soul? But why? King Asgore's been collecting them for a while. The good old king has six of them now. Whoa, I forgot it was that many. So one more soul and that barrier will be toast. That's right, nephew. Then brownies could finally serve humans like we used to again. The last soul was me? No way it was you. You're a ghost monster. I... I'm so... Hey! Is that the place? Oh, yes, that's it. Well, say, you're making that sad face again. It, it's nothing. I'm just wondering when your parents want me to put you down. I think Breeze wants to get down. I understand. Thank you so much, Faye. Yeah, thank you! I'll talk to Miss Hana and be right back, okay? Mm. Uh, another visitor so soon? How strange. Oh, it's you again, Faye. And who is your friend? Ron. Nice to meet you, Bron. Oh, hey, dear, you look worried. Did something happen? Miss Hana, we need your help. There's a human out to get us. Yes, we evacuated the Snowden to keep them safe. But they need somewhere safe to hide. And the best place I could think of was your house. I hope that's okay, Miss Hana. Uh, I... Without me. Miss Hana, wait! Miss Hana! Huh? Ah! Didn't I tell you to ask me for popping through doors? Please. Please. I just make things worse. Like I always do. Everything will go terribly wrong. Everyone will. I don't think I can handle it. Not again. Please leave. They will be better off if I'm not involved. It's my fault, Miss Hana. What? I know the king needs one more soul to break the barrier. That last soul should have been me. If I didn't become a ghost, then you all wouldn't be trapped down here with that human. This happened because I messed it up. I don't belong here. 
I know that. I'm sorry. Huh? It's not your fault, dear. It is. I... I know it is. That can't be right. There's no way. There's no way it's your fault. Open your eyes. Hey, dear. Is it okay if I touch you? Oh, uh, sure. Sure, sure. I need you to listen to me, okay? Blaming yourself for everything. It will only push people away. It took me over 40 years. And now I finally understand what my son was trying to tell me. I shouldn't be afraid to help with something this important. Stand tall now. No more blaming yourself. I'm going to try my best if you do. Okay? So you'll help? Of course, dear. Thank you so much. I'll do my best, Miss Anna. Took you long enough. But Ron, be polite. I was talking to him. <gasps> How long were you going to stand around for? I know you sense them. A whole village worth of brownies in the middle of nowhere. You thought that was normal? I, 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 uh... Oh, that's right. You don't like us seeing you. I won't look. Does that help? Stop your shivering. Those big bodies are just as scared as you. <laughs> I, I saw Lily, so I thought... There's more than just your family that needs help right now. Those brownies gotta get out of this snow, and you know where they can hide. You need to be the one to show them inside. Get going! Thank you, dear. Anyone who is cold, please come inside. I don't have many chairs, but please make yourselves comfortable. Are you going inside? No worries. We're made for handling the cold. Oh! You're building shelters! What a good idea! Is there anything we can do to help? Of course there is. Maybe not for the little guy, though. Hey! I can handle it! So this is where you've been, Aspen. <laughs> We haven't heard from you in years. Mom, is that...? I'm surprised you even came out. <laughs> Lily was always a lot braver than me. Nonsense. You got some spark, just like your sister. I'm just glad you found someplace safe and quiet to live. You're so big now, Flurry. Yep! You know, with that human running around. <laughs> There's really a, a, a human? Cousin Bron told us about it. Uh, I... I thought he was just saying that to get attention. <laughs> Aspen, Bron isn't a nub-nose anymore. He's an adult now, and he wouldn't lie about something like this. T sorry. Guess I've been away too long. I didn't realize. I know you two have never seen eye to eye, but you need to trust him on this. I, uh... Excuse me, sir. That is your house, right? My daughter is getting cold. Could we come inside? Uh, uh, oh, um, of course. But please follow me. Sorry for the wait.